Hello, I need my and um today I'm going to be showing you how to build a bird bath. So right now I'm using this. I cut a hole inside of our little table here that I made. It's kinda of like a hanging table. Um I cut it with this jigsaw right here. I cut it round. First as you see I made a mark. Right there, with and I put the pot on top of here, and I marked around it, and then I came on a little bit because, as you see, it's a little ring right there. So what I did for that was bring it in a little bit because you can't go inside there in the market, so. So I did, I did that, and I got that. So I put the pot on top, just like so, and marked all the way around it with a pin. Then I took it off, marked closer in. See, mark closer in. And so then this piece, that right, right here, can go and hang itself right there so there you go and I have this little stick here and I just dug a little hole there into the gravel and that's going to be connecting to the pot so you got that hole in the pot and I have I already have a hole in the pot where the screws are going to go and the pot into here. And then you might be thinking it might leak, but it's not gonna leak because I have a some mud that I'm going to be using for there. So it won't leak. So now I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take this screw right here and put it right into the hole and that's going to connect to that board right there so that's going to do I'm going to see if I can show you as much as I can so you see in that here just find where the other hole is it's kind of screw it just a little bit in by hand. Let's see, I screwed it in a little bit by hand. I screwed it in a little bit. So let me go to my drill and put the right bit on there. So the new type of bit looks like this. I'm just going to connect it to the drill. And then, I'm just going to come up here and drill it. I know sometimes you may have to turn timber like I just did here. I'm not going to be able to show you everything, but I'll show you as much as I can. Another thing that you don't want to do is strip your skewer out. Once you've gotten that, you're just going to make sure the stick is lined up before you have it. Just, you know, see that gap right there? I don't know if you can see that. 
but you want that gap to be close. But you bring it more that way. At least pretty much close. See the pot is nice and all fresh in here. So there you go. Got that one there. I'm just gonna cover the whole neck up. And so that's mine this should be it. Right there. Oh, now I got that sick here. Yeah. Yeah. Just gonna stir it just one more time. It's nice and tight. And so it's pretty tight. And so there you go. This is part one of how to build a bird bath.